Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got these uh, two blue shaded uh, triangles uh, A, F, D and in this other blue triangle uh, B, F, E fully confined in a right triangle uh, A, B, C as you can see in this uh, diagram such that uh, this segment uh, A, F is equal to this segment uh, E, F and moreover, uh, this uh, segment uh, CD is uh, 8 units and this segment uh, EB is uh, 4 units. And now our task is uh, to calculate the area of this uh, blue shaded region, this area and this area combined. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. And please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started and here's our very first step. The only info that has been given to us is that uh, this uh, EB segment uh, length is 4 and this CD segment length uh, is uh, 8 and these uh, side uh, segment uh, CE is uh, unknown. Likewise, this uh, segment uh, AD is uh, unknown uh, as well. So therefore, we are going to think uh, outside the box to make our job uh, simple. So therefore we are going to draw some uh, auxiliary lines and we are going to connect uh, these two points uh, D and uh, E as you can see in this uh, next step and as a result we are ended up uh, with another uh, triangle uh, EFD and now let's focus on these uh, two triangles this triangle uh, AFD and this other triangle uh, E F D and now let's make an observation we can see the base of this uh, triangle is uh, A F and the base of this uh, other triangle is uh, E F both are congruent and furthermore uh, the height of this uh, triangle is uh, D P and likewise the height of this uh, other triangle E F D is uh, dp as well so therefore we conclude that the area of this uh, triangle uh, afd is equal to the area of this uh, other triangle uh, efd as you can see in this uh, equation if i label uh, the area of this triangle uh, afd as uh, a sub 1 the area of this uh, other triangle efd is going to be a sub 1 uh, as well and now let's assume the area of this uh, triangle uh, BFE is uh, A sub 2 so therefore it is sufficient to say that the blue shaded uh, region area is going to be equal to the area of this uh, big triangle uh, DBE we are talking about uh, this triangle uh, DBE this whole uh, area since the area of this triangle is equal to the area of uh, this triangle so therefore now our task is uh, to calculate the area of this uh, triangle uh, DBE so therefore now we are going to calculate the area of this uh, triangle uh, DBE and now let's recall the area of a triangle formula area equals to a half times uh, base uh, times height and now we can see for this triangle uh, DBE if we label this side uh, as uh, our base uh, then uh, this uh, is going to be the height uh, of uh, this triangle DBE so therefore the base uh, of this triangle turns out to be 4 and the height uh, is uh, 8 so therefore we are going to fill in the this formula so this is going to give us uh, 1 divided by 2 times our base is 4 times height uh, is 8 so if we simplify everything on the right hand side that is going to give us uh, 16 so therefore the area of the triangle DEB turns out to be 16 square units and since uh, we know that uh, blue shaded region area is equal to the area of this uh, triangle uh, DBE and our uh, DBE area is uh, 16 so therefore we conclude that this uh, blue shaded region area is going to be 16 uh, square 
units. So therefore, after all the calculations and manipulations, the area of this uh, blue shaded region turns out to be 16 uh, square units. So therefore, the area of uh, this uh, blue shaded region is going to be 16 uh, square units. And that's our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.